from the driver of a stolen Dodge being arrested after a 100 miles per hour chase to the three county chase that ended when the suspect crashed into an embankment. More high speed police chases that will keep you glued to your seat. Let's get it on. A stolen truck in Florida led police on a high speed chase while the driver was driving under the influence. The vehicle was stopped by police on Interstate 95. The suspect, Rochelle Jennings Sylvain, was charged with auto theft, driving under the influence, failure to obey traffic laws, and several other charges.
Officer David Calvert spotted a stolen white Dodge pickup truck accelerating at over 100 miles per hour, leading police on a chase. The chase lasted about nine miles before the driver suddenly stopped and surrendered. We are shot. The suspect, identified as Lonnie Hansen, had multiple felony warrants and was arrested on several charges. The driver of a green Honda SUV was arrested after crashing into two Florida Highway Patrol vehicles while trying to evade a traffic stop. Thank <laughs> you. 
Joseph Sanders is in jail and facing a long list of charges. police involved in a three-county chase with suspect Durkee Zing.
Dirk Ising lost control of his vehicle on I-95 near SR-207 and crashed into a grassy embankment. Dirk Ising was taken into custody without further incident. No bail was set on the felony charges. A U-Haul reported stolen in Clayton County was spotted speeding, leading to a high-speed chase. Made a left into Homestone Road. Speeds 50, traffic light. Green stop sign pads in Homestead Circle. Homestead on where? I'm making a left into Minnow Road from Homestead Road. Radio, see if Henry County or GSP is available. 
cross over Panola Road, still eastbound on Ferry Road. I will attempt. Speed 75 miles an hour, traffic. Condition flight. There's somebody behind you. Negative, I'm still by, by myself. Setting up for a pit. Sheriff Johnson initiated a traffic stop. The suspect, identified as Oliver, was a wanted felon and was taken for medical attention before being taken into custody. A BMW X5 stolen by Mr. Dixon stopped briefly but then sped away. The chase ended with a pit maneuver, pinning the BMW to the guardrail.
He was arrested and later identified through fingerprints at the Morgan County Jail. I'll be around here. Yeah, I'll give you update 123. A white Chevy Trax was swerving at speeds approaching 91 miles per hour. Police stopped the driver and identified him as Sean Anthony Gura Chung. I'm not 
Sean Anthony Gura Chung was booked on charges of distribution of cocaine, possession of a controlled substance, fleeing and eluding, and unlawful use of a communication device. Thank you for watching the entire video. Which moment impressed you the most? If you like this video, please subscribe to the channel for new videos every day. See you again.